bracket match, Jimmy Joe versus Sombrero. Three, two, Sombrero us. went with Kirby. Uh, Sombrero hailing from, I believe, in Canada. At least Mexico. Baja. Okay, Mexico. Either Mexicali or Insana. Those are the hubs of the Baja Smash. Uh, relatively new scene. Jimmy Joe, of course, a, a legacy player. Uh, yes. Expert commentator. Ooh. I've seen a couple. I've seen a couple matches of Sombrero. I'm here to see what he really, what he's really got. You know, it would have been better if he back through there. It would have been more damage. I've studied this matchup, you know, some, and I know that generally speaking, you wanna, you know, you forward throw when you know you're gonna get a kill. You back throw when. Uh, he basically because it, it doesn't matter. For Kirby, right. yes. Exactly. Do you know um, what good wins does Sombrero have? I don't know. Like his best wins, okay. You know, all I know is um, I played him in the last ODS two years ago. Okay. You know, it was relatively good, good, uh, good Kirby. Um, pretty campy. Still, apparently, pretty campy, but I, I think, you know, if he's making it into freaking bracket, He's, he's going to show some stuff, you know? Don't, don't, well, let's judge by the match at hand, you know? Only Kirby? Yeah, yeah, I, I've never heard or seen him play any other character. This is honestly probably my first time actually watching Jimmy Joe as well. Oh, cool, cool, cool. I mean, I can almost concur because I, I mean, I've never seriously watched, you know, Jimmy yeah, Joe play. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I watch the high level matches all the time. Or the higher level matches all the time. Right. Well, it looks like it's you know relatively even. You know, no surprise that Jimmy Joe, the more experienced player, is a little bit ahead. Oh, a little bit of lag. Okay. Nair did not finish it off at 106. Oh no no no! Well, that worked. That oh, that down. up air probably was not on purpose. Forward but it, throw, forward air. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Good jumps. <clears throat> nice and patient. Knows that the bear is very powerful. Count those jumps, yep. Yeah, I playing it right. <clears throat> Some people may frown upon Kirby's in general or the play style, you know, a lot of back airs and uh, up tilts, up but yep. that's the way this game is played. Don't hit the player, he, you know. But that's, the up tilts are a little bit of a commitment for Kirby against Pikachu. One grab from Pikachu on the floor. See, I like this. I like the safety. He's just, he needs to just stay on the platform. Some else should just stay on the platform. I haven't seen too much up, up tilt combos. Right. Um, you know, on the, on the same general note, like, you, people have this idea that it's just brainless. But it's not. I mean, you really have to know what you're doing. You yep. can't, you, you know I mean? It is not as simple as, oh, stay on the side plot and up tilt, and like, you'll win. Like, no, of course, I mean, come on, think about that for two seconds. You can't, you can't do that sort of thing. And he Back also in. cannot simply roll in on Jimmy Joe like that. He knows <clears throat> that stuff is coming. But he does have the lead right now. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, no, 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 no. I don't know but if that was an intentional down smash. Yeah, I mean... Like I said before, I think... Space that out, Sombrero. There you go, yes. Not too aggressive. Sombrero needs yes. to do more back throws. I like his dashing, yes. Yeah, he has pretty good movement. I mean, he's not... <clears throat> I was watching him a little bit early. He was <gasps> surprisingly slow, but now it looks like he's about as crisp as you would want. No, yeah, it's, it's crisp right now. Oh. The second up air that has worked for him. Get that grab, Jimmy. There it is. Do something with that. Oh, Ooh. wow. Oh, very good. Oh, very good. <gasps> there. Yeah. Great combo. Great damage. This is. Oh. Yes. Jimmy Joe playing it right, as we know wow. he would. Oh, yep. oh yes. Jimmy Joe, baby. Backwards. Backwards. I think he wanted to grab ledge, but uh, I think he kind of got lucky. 
forward. I mean, pivot to back air. I'm so tickled to see that because it's just like you know, it shows the you know Jimmy chose a legacy player yeah. and a legacy player would do exactly that. Yeah. Oh, I've done those before. I've, I've done those before. The crossing crossing under the map back on. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm yeah. I, I'd say like I. Pika. It only it only worked in that situation because Kirby had I think he just died or he was either off map so he was able to come yeah, back. Yeah. If Kirby was on map, it, it would have been a grab, a down tilt, something. <clears throat> I should mention that K Kirby is my like probably my weakest character. Um, I probably only played with Kirby fifteen. I mean, less than twenty times, more than ten times. I don't since play 1999. with. I don't play with Kirby, but I watch him. I watch him enough. I mean, P, P guy. I'm mean, saying. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, I'm seeing like I see what you're saying is that once that this matchup you haven't seen too much of. Yep. You know. I've seen as much of this matchup as Pika did. I see. I see. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But this okay, is sombrero. a good game. He's about to close it out right now. Ooh. Great four throw. Oh, no chain throw. Now go for the grab. Oh. Nice. That is, um, I think, peak, uh, Kirby's fast move. Four tilt. Comes out the fastest. Fa comes out faster than grab. Ooh! Yeah, no. that's stock. You can't get that triple, you know, that third will up there that works out for you. Will the spacing, will he be able to space this out? Get the, get those forward, air, the up airs he needs. There is a minute and a half left. Oh! He can easily just play so-called lane, camp it out, yep. space it out. Ooh! Yep. They're like that. Yeah, finish it out. Yeah. That's game one. That's it, man. Sombrero up one. Wow, what a game. Last final stop. I mean, at this point, put, putting Baja more on the map, you know. Oh, yeah. Shout out to Baja. Yeah. Um, I think, you know, I, I can't really John for Jimmy Joe. I mean, he's. it looks like he's playing pretty Both well. Both of these guys are using Horries. <laughs> and they, they, good map. Tommy, close the door, man. No, stranded. Stranded knows what's up. It's just he's um <laughs> he, he drank. He's on a level right now. Yeah, <laughs> stranded's on level. I'm love watching him right now. Forward up, up to up to back air. Oh, no, 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 back air would have connected. I don't know. Uh, Jimmy Joe's needs to yes. get back up there. Ooh, okay. no, 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 no. Forward down. He died out of that, Jimmy? I, I'm not sure. Either. I'm just thinking that um, Pikachu has, you know, one thing I've seen that works a lot, especially in this matchup, and Boom actually uh, made an entire video commenting that if Pika's under, under the ledge, you can basically... Um, Come from underneath and from the side. He does not need to come from above. Ooh, all right. When Kirby is trying to uh, camp that top flat. Um, and, uh, you underneath know, or from the side? Uh, like basically, what I'm trying to say is that Pika does not need to be above a Kirby. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh win. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, we got Beef and Blanke coming up after this set. Oh, Beef. Oh, my God. That would be a great set. Okay. So, a big strength is um, Pika's um, up air. You know, there's no hurt box. His back air, his up air, his... I mean, all, every, I mean yes, really everything. But, but like, against, yes, against Kirby, especially, it's his up air. Yes. Yeah, I said that. Yeah. Those chain up airs, exactly. I mean that, and that is basically what you use. Uh, it's hard to di out. I feel like you can di out of an up tilt from Pikachu. He's not di out. Of it. <clears throat> nice awareness from Sombrero to you know utilize that uh, that upper hitbox from that uh, Kirby rebear. He 
even. Yeah, he does. The back air does cover cover above Kirby, and a little bit of forward of him. Yeah, I mean it's it's quite everything, massive. Everything it. above him actually. Yeah. Oh, oh, nice that. There's a, a bit of nerves. I mean, it could Jimmy, have been a missed tech. No, no, yeah, but I mean, Jimmy, Jimmy Joe usually plays quite clean, but like, I, you know, literally, I mean, we're on the subject. Uh, I looked into Jimmy Joe's eyes, like literally maybe 15, 20 minutes ago, and uh, I don't know if he's tired or what. So, but still, he, he's playing pretty clean though. Yeah, yeah, he um, uh, he has some he has some not vision problems, but there's something bugging his eye right now. Oh, right? So okay. Li like I don't literally. I don't think it's impairing him. I don't think it's like he's not playing massive. fine. He's no, no, no. Fine. It would bug me. I know that because uh, we're not sure if he has to itch his eye right now. Someone should be standing next to him, itching his eye every second. <laughs> <laughs> great, great, great trade. All right, he needs to pull something. He needs to close this stock quick. Like that? Nope. Man, that's, I mean. Oh, what? no. All right. Um, this tech from Sombrero, too. SD. <clears throat> I mean, when, when he you're. He has to win this neutral. He has to win this neutral. Jimmy will even it back up right here. He will. Grab. Wow. Uh, I'm surprised he got through any up tilts in that situation. Oh. Oh, three. Down there. Oh, forward there. A down air would have trapped him on top flat, I think, and he could have done a smash. Yeah, but I mean, what, what he did there did work enough for him. Forward. Ooh. I know. Okay. I don't know if he read that. Back air. Oh. Ooh. Great. Great move. Hmm. That know, was aggressive, because an up tilt, I think, would have would have countered that in up from Pika? I don't I didn't see what percentage he was at, but I mean I, I'm just impressed in general. If any Kirby gets I mean that was on purpose. Yeah, no, he know? yeah he pushed that yeah definitely. That's just impressive for Kirby move. to get this sort of bracket and to get a kill from an from an up smash like that. I mean my, I tip my hat to that that, that you know Sombrero re deserves respect. Ooh, Oh! It's a little simplistic, but it works. There we go. Not over for Jimmy Joe. He's going to do something. Pull this out. Sombrero took a little little second. <clears throat> now, Jimmy Joe is a fighter. He, he, he will fight to the bitter end. And But, I mean, my recollection of my matches... Uh, with Sombrero two years ago. Oh man, he he's a patient player. He will, he will return the favor. Yeah. He's got two minutes. All right. He's got plenty of time. Ooh. Ah. Uh, uh. Jimmy Joe. I didn't see I if he did that. Thought. Oh, that's going to close it, yep. Oh, it's best of five. That's right. Is it best of five? I'm assuming now that all top 16 yeah. is best of five, but it's single elimination. I, that's it. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. <coughs> best of five. And uh, I like that. Best of five in a single elimination is a cool. That's a cool little turn. That's a cool. I, like I mean, that. it's. I don't know if this has ever really been done before. Um, I've never heard of single elimination in a North American tournament to begin with. But they're making it relatively uh, fair, you could say, because I think, they're doing I think five Grant. stocks. Yes, yeah. And uh, best of five. I like it. Grand final should be four stock, best of seven. Again, for the kids at home, we got uh, Bruins on the mic, and uh, we have my co commentator here, AFP. AJP. AJP. <laughs> <laughs> the only reason I screwed that up is because Sheer is uh, wrote mm, certain people's names on some of the pool, uh, paper pools. And Jimmy uh, Joe has to win three straight games to stay in the tournament. Yeah, that's 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 pretty rough. I mean, 
Since Emperor's shown that, you know, he's a full of them. He's to be taken seriously. Ooh. Down tilt would have caught that. Ah, I missed the nair. Missed the drop though. Plat drop nair. Now the fourth throw would definitely kill from any point here. Any plat? Yeah. Any platform, yeah. Any plot and in the the uh, ground floor. The ground floor. Oh, okay. Yeah. <clears throat> First uh, pointer I ever learned in you know in competitive Smash is you can. It, it sounds extremely simple, but you really don't want to land with an aerial in front of your opponent. I mean, as simple as that sounds, because they just simply grab you. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. No, no. Oh. Maybe? I don't think he was trying to actually suck off uh, the rat there. He, <laughs> he was... He, I think he, he was, it was a, a sort of a mind game, fake out. He grabbed the ledge and everything, but... Jimmy Joe with the lead here. Until, there, there we go. Yeah. Back. Ooh! Yeah. All right, Jimmy Joe. See, yeah. A back air from Kirby would kill. Oh, that's gonna kill. That will not kill. Wild. Read from Sombrero and uh, good, good for him for closing out that stock. <clears throat> Jimmy still, yeah, still up. up a stock. He needs to keep that stock. He needs to take another one right here. There it is. Back air. Oh. <laughs> Full Ooh. right in. Up air would have hit. Okay. Ooh. No. If he, oh. I mean, good to Jimmy Joe to do that. Maybe he was extra lucky, but. Uh, uh, no oh, no, no, no. Yeah, without a doubt. Forward. I mean, up air. Up air. Oh, All that right. killed. Oh. Yeah, it's little things like that. Like, I, I, yeah, I know almost 100% that Jimmy knows all the percentages for all the kills for anything that Beacon okay. has to do against Kirby. Okay. Crap. Oh, wow. He doesn't need to be aggressive. He just, yeah, they, ooh. Yeah, he didn't go for that third up, that third up oh, air. Oh yeah, that would have been really bad. That would have been. Oh. Back air. Good up air. All right. I would have stood and opted for a down tilt. He went for the the ledge. At this point, yeah, this is obviously Jimmy Joe's game. Like, this is his game to lose now. Yep. See if Jimmy Joe will win this neutral. Oof. Two minutes and 40 seconds left on the clock. Plenty of time. Oh. Great ground. Wow.
One more grab. Oh, you, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was aggressive. What? Usually not a wise thing in North American version. A pivot, a pivot grab could have been bad right there. Damn, it's close. In percentage. I don't think that was intentional. I think he wanted both jumps. Good forwarder. So Burrow is very wisely just resorting to bears, keeping him off the ground. Oh. Ooh. That down tilt's gonna close that stop. Okay. The game Grab. is not over, folks. That's over. Yeah. The 3-0 did not happen. Sombrero had headphones on, and uh, he took it off his, his third match, like, after his third stock loss. We're going to game four. Sombrero two, Jimmy Joe one. I think he's uh, asking <clears throat> one of its one of his uh, friends who drove her level seven Pepperina to get him some water. <clears throat> Both players look like they're in, you know, relatively high spirits. They're playing, uh, you know, pretty optimally. Oh yeah, Jimmy, Jimmy's uh, calculating that. Everything he did right, what he needs to keep doing. Still a mountain. Two more games for Jimmy. Sombrero just has to win this game. Right. You never discount that. Um, Jimmy needs to look at it like winning this game is winning the set. He doesn't need to see two games against this guy. He needs to see winning this game. You know, I think that that's a, that's a thing in sports and esports in general. Like, you know, if you look at it that yeah. way, you don't look at it like, oh, I got to win X amount. Like, you know, if I win this one, you know, spiritually, I've yeah. got the entire thing. But he'll have the momentum. The momentum will completely yeah, yeah. be on Jimmy Joe's side. Momentum is a real thing. <laughs> and, uh, game three would just be, I mean, game five would just be sick for this first ODS3 bracket match. Single elimination right here. Loser of this is out of the tournament. Man, yeah, nice. Every mm. All right, role play snare. Sometimes it's hard to recover <clears throat> as Kirby against Puka. Um, hard to know exactly what to do, but uh, that was a role play snare. Forward, okay. That'll kill? Nope. Wow. You have to be in the low teens and do a grab on the side plat for it to work. Very close. Yeah, no way. Wow. Ooh, burning up so many jumps. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you're not going to pull that stuff with uh, Jimmy Joe. Yeah. Completely even. Yeah. This is, you know. You definitely want to use all your as much jumps as you can towards the towards the stage. That's what the trigger is at. If you're using all your jumps away from the stage, that's a ledge guard. Yeah, you, you definitely have to be conscious of what you're doing. Ooh, all right. Nice little down tilt, but. You know. Will Jimmy Joe do something with this? Ah, oh, he misses Whoa. the down air. Trade. You know, those, those giant oh. Yeah, 
Jimmy Joe wants to grab. Somehow wants an up tilt. Oh. Um, or an air. I mean, I mean, I think. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, good back air. A, a good strong oh, bear. Oh wow. Would do it. <clears throat> and this is. This is wise of Sombrero. I mean, this is the way the match is played. You gotta get that bear in. But right now, he's trying to win this neutral here. But he's gonna mix up a little bit more. Yeah, it's a little more advantageous to, to, to Kirby. Kirby, you know, his dare is extremely powerful. You can fast fall and dare it. It's just like, very hard to avoid. There's a lot of damage. It can lead to a lot of things. Of, uh, yeah. Back just, arrow close. No, no, no. Yes. I think one of Sombrero's weaknesses, he just burns too many jumps on his attempt to Ooh. to recover. Yeah. That's enough. Yeah, well, that'll wait. kill. Gotcha. I don't know the percents of his forward throws. I think the absolute highest, I mean, the minimum is like maybe 119. No, lowest. What's lowest on top flat? Top flat. I think it's um yeah, like, like don't quote me on this, but like 98, 98 exactly. Yeah, I was thinking 98. The lowest. Yeah. Yeah, it would be 98. Ooh. I think it's up to a This is maybe. close right here. Let's go, Jimmy Joe. Take it to game five. Ooh. He's missing. He's missing so many up tilts. And I mean, there was we got a little di there. I was gonna say, not where's the di from Jimmy Joe? There, there was some there. Ooh. Don't go under him. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. I. That's, that's was he aware effect. of the damage in that situation? I would have like up tilted more. He did one up tilt into a into a nair. Um, sombrero or um, sombrero? Yeah. I'm. I'm. He, I'm sure he had a combo plan. I'm sure. What is that? That's what happens. It seems like he's going for Fukuro type combos where he's basically going up tilts to down airs. And he's just judging on the percentage and how he's teching or DIing, then you kind of go from there. How you. Whoa, Aye. what a clank. And the stock. That was an up air and an up tilt. Ooh! Fortress and Rare can capitalize on that. Oh! That. Oh. oh! Okay. Was that a read? I think so, because like. The average, I think, Pika player would just simply assume that Kirby's going to go off stage. Yeah, I would have back air. I would have went for a back air. Yeah, that was a good read by Jimmy Drew. Trade. You know, I've heard it said from other players is that, uh, I mean, that Sombrero might be the campiest player at this tournament. Jimmy needs this. And keep him there. Keep him on the ledge. Nope. He let him get top. Let him get top flat. Maybe Jimmy Joe needs to give him a taste of his own medicine, like, you know, we're a minute and a half left on the clock. Get up there. Back it. Oh. No, no, no. Oh! Oh, man. That was too bad. I mean, I, I don't know if I can name a time when, you know, it, it was an, an okay option for a Kirby to, to, to no. rock like that. I almost wish that Jimmy Joe could have. Oh! That wasn't intentional. He did that as That's not intentional. No, Jimmy Joe. He slipped. His very. Head. I mean, relatively distraught by that, but he yeah. needs a. He, he, he can, needs a grab. This game is not over. Jimmy Let's Joe. Go, Jimmy. Definitely seal this out. Seal this up. Sombrero. Sombrero can move on after Ooh. taking this last stock. Oh, no. So down. Oh, oh, he wanted the reverse. Smash. Oh, it was the down air. 20, 27 oh. seconds. Of Get up on top. Clock. Clock. What? Some, I mean, you cannot fault Sombrero for timing this out. 
damn. No. I mean, I'm not Jimmy's. Uh, he has, he has to be aware. He has to be aware. He 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 is, but. I mean, what can you do? I mean, this is an inherently campy, slow matchup. And Jimmy Joe, a timeout, essentially concedes. Um, you know, there's maybe eight Sombrero seconds left wins the clock. wins three to one. 